second trivia. In what year was the first spacewalk completed? 1957, 1965, 1969, or 1972? In March of 1965, a Soviet cosmonaut took the first spacewalk. An American astronaut followed three months later. The anniversary of that is next week on June 3rd. It'll mark 56 years since astronaut Ed White took a walk in space. It was one thing to get outside the Gemini 4 capsule in orbit. It was another to actually get work done, according to NASA. So astronauts on subsequent missions began training underwater so they'd have an idea about what it'd be like in space. Separation the spacecraft. Okay, separation the spacecraft at this time, The airlock uh, hatch came open. Immediately inside the airlock itself, it was bathed in this beautiful color of blue. And it was a light reflecting off the, the ocean below. And I saw, saw the planet Earth and just my feet just dangling there. And I thought to myself, you know, this is absolutely beautiful. I, I can't believe that I'm here. And then I said, okay, we got work to do. Okay, and then at this point, then Nicole will just have you go towards your feet between the modules. And Danny, once you have that fuse tether in place uh, before you BRT to the handrail, the process associated with actually going out the door begins months beforehand. Understanding the, 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 the choreography of what's going to take place over an eight hour period. What are the technical challenges for that particular activity? You are your own self-contained vessel. Um, you have your own oxygen system, your own power supply, your own communication system. Uh, you have obviously all the tools that you brought with you. You have the ability to reject the heat that you're building up as you're working inside the spacesuit. So you have to kind of manage all that as your own little independent spacecraft out there. And because we can rely heavily on our training, that allows us to not be overwhelmed with the things that you just can't emulate here on the ground. At the end of our first spacewalk, I stopped on the truss just for a second, and it was nighttime. And I looked down below, and I could it was I knew exactly where I was. I was over the Indian Ocean because I could see the the lights along the, the coastline. It's just such a uh, an incredible feeling to to just be able to see that, to take that in, and kind of be able to be in that moment.